Hey everyone, as you can see, I'm not alone today. I'm back with Nick, he's COVID free. Yeah, after being basically shut in one room for the best part of 10 days to not pass it on to Rachel, who had remained negative the entire time, it's quite a relief to be back out. Definitely makes you appreciate the small things. So with that, we have decided that we wanted to revisit some of our favorite coffee shops that we discovered along the way when we were doing our coffee walks. So we wanted to take you along and share them with you. We're currently on one of our famous Toronto neighborhood walks and we thought we would show you one of our favorite coffee shops, it's called Found. So when we initially started doing this, um, then we quite quickly ran out of places that we wanted to go, so ended up having to do quite a lot of Googling, but this was probably one of the first places, it was kind of one of the first new places that we ended up finding and it came very highly rated. So. We went here, loved it, and just kept coming back. Found is a really popular cafe and it was so busy in there that there was actually nowhere to sit inside. So here we are outside. Yep, brave in the cold. Fun times. The only issue that we have with this cafe is that it is small, so it's hard to find seating sometimes. But when you do get seating inside, it's super cozy. The reason that we really like this place is not just because um, their espresso is delicious, but and the options that they have are really, really good. And also there's some real thought and attention to detail that they put into this. So what we are currently both drinking is what is called the Doctor. And that is a flat white with a double espresso shot. So you get a little bit more coffee for your buck. The thing that I really like about this place is that they actually choose the coffee bean based on the type of milk that you order. So for example, because I order mine with oat milk, I get a different coffee bean than Nick does who gets his with skim milk and the bean and the milk are meant to complement one another. It's for reasons like this that this has been one of our firm favorites ever since we started doing these coffee walks. Cheers, babe. Cheers. Good morning, Toronto! As you can see, it is a super snowy morning, but we're gonna head out and get some coffee anyway. Let's go brave this weather, Nick. So today we are headed to a place called Sam James Coffee Bar. It is another independent coffee shop in the middle of the city and it has several different locations dotted around. Thankfully for us, we have one which is about five, 10 minute walk away from us. The reason that we like this, honestly, is mostly just due to the quality of the coffee itself but also it is a local business we do love to support local businesses and on top of that 
not only are they supporting themselves as a local business but they also partner with other ones they are also partnering up with robinson bakery at this location to also provide baked goods let's check it out So that was just a couple of places that we really, really enjoy. We hope to bring you some more in the future. But yeah, until the next time, take care. And keep smiling. <laughs>